everybody, I'm Matthew Wild 6970 and welcome back to yet another episode of TS Craft. Today we're going to be getting into building a portal room. I mean portal building for the server because we just moved out to a new area and I just got on board when they were just about doing it, so I figured I'll help out a little bit with the server. Right down there is where I'm building the world building and over here is actually Fiery's base and I'm just borrowing this little ledge of his for a bed for temporary be for temporary basis. Uh to begin I have everything all situated, all planned out. All I have to do is just come along here and just place blocks and ready to rock and roll today. That's more of exciting. In fact, I could probably do it all on cam. You know what I didn't do again? I forgot to actually, I would say, eh, maybe start a timer. Mm -hmm. When I first started this. Oh, 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 oh. Ah, shoot. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Hopefully you didn't place too many blocks. Oh, no, it didn't. Good. I'm not quite used to this, this builder wand. Okay, we got one. Do, 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 Okay, I'm getting hang of this. Oh, oh, oh. Dang it. Uh, the dimensions of this wall is actually... 9 by 30? 1? You were curious. Oh wow, did I? No, I didn't run out of bricks. And finally, you just get this wall. Now, I'm eventually. Oh, goodness gracious. Not what I wanted. Good thing I have a pick! Oh man, I'm not used to this wand. Alright. Looks like I'm gonna have to start the wall here. Uh huh. Tell it to how to do this. Get this thing all situated. This is the only thing I don't like about the wand is that it cannot recognize what pattern you need. Okay, there we go. Got it. All right. Now there is the pattern. I would just need to go along here with the wand and fill it in. Alright, so I'm gonna do the rest of that off cam and get an idea of what how long I'm going here so far. And finish this wall. Be right back in a few seconds. Alright, I've did the walls, we're inside the walls. Now, since we're inside the walls, now we just gotta find the center point of this center points and we'll just go along here and we'll figure out okay we're just two okay come on give me give me give me give me the correct 10 11 12 13 14 15 it would be right here so this is getting knocked out here all right, and let's see what, check this side, just to make sure I'm even. Just to make sure. 11, 14, 15, okay. The question is, which side should I knock out? <laughs> this, this original thought was to do double doors here so that'd be 13 this is getting knocked out too and that be knocked out okay okay that's getting knocked out that's getting knocked out that's knocked out that's knocked out now that should give me one two one more but that way we've got like a two by two door is here and now we just do the other side and man airbrite is having some issues 
good day. For some reason. All right, so over here, the same thing. Oh, and over here. Give me fifteen. Give me fifteen. Do I have a fifteen? Fourteen. I'm knocking this out right here. Knocking that out, knock this out, this out, this, this, these, and that, okay. Alright, oh, I got F7 still on. Oh, there we go. Yeah, alright, now it's this side's turn to get the good old thing. Thirteen, sixteen, and ten, eleven. A little bit of a leg. Oh, so thirteen, fourteen. All right, you get knocked out. You, 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 and you. You, you, you. So I give it two doors. And the frame around it. Okay, finally this last wall. Okay, where are we? Get, get the tape measure out. See where we need to set this up. I love this thing. Okay, uh, oh, I need to set it. I love this measuring tape in Minecraft. I mean, it makes it so much easier. Figure out where the center of things are. A 13, 14, and bam. Knock this out, knock you out. Couple more on top. Couple more over here. Couple more over on this side. All right, now we got a way out and a way for me to actually access my chest over here that I can, oh, it's over here. Now that I got access to these chests, I can easily grab the stuff I was wanting to grab for this next part of this build. Okay, this one needs to go out. Okay, that can move. I need these doors. All right. So, let me go like that. Let's... Okay, for a door jam type thing, I was thinking about going around like this. I uh, um, should probably... Figure out what, oh yeah, I was going to do this, these needs to get knocked out too. Okay, for the floor. All right, knock these out over here. With my, with my bare hands or are these, I don't have a normal shovel on me. I just got a excavator. All right, we got this. All right, we got these in place. Uh, I should probably grab a couple blocks for the door as well. All right. Uh-huh. Got those, knock these out. Just like this. Okay, the, now we've got the doors. Now we just need to get the floor started as well. Alright, let me grab some concrete and this other type, which is... Wait a minute. Oh, partially weathered concrete? <laughs> and weathered concrete. What? I thought I had this all organized. Well, looks like I didn't. The reason why I chose, the reason why I'm doing partial and weathered is because of the simple fact that they got almost the same texture look, but the issue is, is that you, these connect, I mean, won't, the issue is if you use more like one lock type for the whole thing, it would connect the textures with them and it will not give this tile look on it 
which was I was wanting to go. Another reason why I chose these chisel blocks is because of some fact that they give you a little speed boost that everybody on the server loves, by the way. Alright, so here, now, oh, 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 wrong button. Over here, this is a partial. So, now again, is this, which one is this? This is concrete. Alright, throw that in there, then we do a partial here. Then we just do a partial here. Then we just do a concrete there, and that'll give us the door, place to put doors. Alright. Go like that, open that up. Alright, I'm going to finish these off cam, and I'll be right back when I finish the floor. See you in a second. Okay, the next step of this build is actually making the portal itself. So... This block right here signifies the center of it, of the building. And I was to just go along here and place down one, two, three, and two in that direction, two in this direction, and three going on up. But first I need to really get on up there. So let's get a dirt block and or cobble one of those two and then we'll just place it down type of thing all right uh-huh hop whoa oh yeah that's right i have a jetpack <laughs> all right so i think this is how i was going to do it too wide uh-huh okay oh 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 jetpack um hover mode okay down we go. Okay, two that way. That, oh, that should do it, I think. Um, duh, 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 duh. So if I'm not mistaken, this is even. Just about with the ceiling here. So let's pull out the tape measure and go over here and click. Uh, three high. I did my measurements a little bit off there, didn't I? All right. Well, anyways, that'll do. <laughs> it, it's a portal. It's going to work. All right. Now, next thing to do is obviously make the platform for which people will stand on and let's turn off my hover mode to disable that so i don't use up the battery on the thing next thing we need to do is do a platform that is three in a distance of three in all directions so it'll be boom 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 three direction three in that way Three in this way. And three in this way. There we go. And I was just basically going to fill this in just like so. And after that, we'll place down some good old carpenter's blocks. And we'll fill it in type of thing. Just like that. Okay. Now we gotta just go along here. I'm gonna do this on cam uh, because it's some fact that it doesn't take that long to do. Plus, I'm on some concrete that gives you a speedy boost. And I really, actually, this is another reason why I chose the concrete. This was it speeds up your travel here in this room building. Uh, I'm gonna be honest with you. I do not know what. Uh, I'm going to do for the actual roof. In fact, that might be something I might do on another day. All right, so here we need to obviously start placing down some carpenter's blocks. All right. And where is this going to be placed? Okay, right there, right? Yep. All right, so now at least I got an idea of where I'm going to place stuff. 
and boom, boom, all the way through here. Boom, boom, oh. Oh, 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 no, no, no. Yep, there we go. Grab that, please. Those things are kind of not so cheap to get. All right, we'll go along here, just like this. All right, so let's work on this corner. And I think I might just do a quick cut right here. Because of some fact that... Oh, whoa, holy moly. That's not what we need. We need to go like this. I goofed that corner up. Okay, well, let's go back up here a little bit. And we'll break that. Go a little bit further. Alright, so we'll go like this. We'll go like that. There we go. It's still not quite right. <laughs> I need to go out further. I keep doing that. Okay, one more. One more. Okay. So, boom. Be boom. Boom. And then, boom and boom. There we go. Hey, that works, Mikey. All right. Anyways, I'm going to be right back in a few seconds. All right. Well, yes, I realized that I uh, turned off my resource pack for the Halloween theme. Yeah. Anyways, the next part is we're going to swap out these, these bricks, these blocks right here, because this thing is one eight. These blocks are one eighth. I mean, one tenth smaller of a hitbox than these and that means you cannot go up them so that to fix it we need to just take these out just like so and we'll place them with some stone brick um i thought i had the stone bricks already took them out already put them in my hot bar but somehow they disappeared on me Hmm. I have to look at my inventory to see where they went. Alright, now that we got those all swapped out, we need to grab... What? Oh, that's right. They, they changed texture because I swapped. <laughs> that's funny. Alright. So we'll place these down just like so. Okay, that's stone brick, correct, right? Okay, it does not look as good as I thought it would be in this texture pack. I kind of forgot I had disabled it when I did this. But anyways, that should fix the issue of being able to go up and down these. The slope. From the carpenter's, uh, from the carpenter's mod. Okay, we'll swap these out. Alright, put these in here just like so. Boom, 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 boom. All right, so do 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 boom 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 boom. Finally, we just do one of these things on along that, and that should basically complete the look and feel of the center platform, I should say, for the Nether portal. Um, a lot of people. Uh, I was talking to some of my teammates here on the server, and they were saying eh, we don't really need another portal. So we got enhanced portals, but I'm like saying, okay, well, this is at least give us the ability, an option to go into the Nether to set up one of those Nether portals for an enhanced portal. We might, then we can probably come along here and swap this out with an actual enhanced portal. Plus, there's room underneath it to run pipes if we need to. In fact, we could probably make a basement. Uh, for That might be another thing that we'll do is we'll make it a basement for this place. That would house all of the necessary components to make uh, these portal, enhanced portals actually work. All right. Okay, here we go. Finally, we got this complete. Last but not least, it's time to light the portal. How exciting. How exciting. This is actually my first time I'll ever be in the nether on the server. So 
So let's see if this thing works, and hopefully I'm not be transported to some random location. Okay, cross my fingers, and why can't, am I crossing my fingers and thinking you guys can see it? Oh, hey, ooh, this is a great spawn. Okay, is this going to take us back to the original location? Nope. It's not. Okay, where am I? Okay. <laughs> um, where is this place? Some secret hideout, I think. Um, nope. No, no, no. Not that way. Well, there's a charge pad right here. Uh, no, that's not one. Alright, looks like going to go down to go up it looks like where is this i've never been here before oh i am lost oh here we go is this the way it came nope well welcome to ts craft server where you get lost when you're a noob on the server is there any way out of here <laughs> is there any okay is that's the only way out of here huh let's do the nether um this is a great build i'm in mean, great location now i need to find a way out of the nether all right well anyways i am going to go back to the portal and call it quits for this episode thanks again for watching uh stay tuned for more videos click that top left corner there and i'll actually take you to my last whispering willows episode i've done here on this channel and if you click on the video playing over in the bottom left corner that actually will take you to my last live stream i've done with my friends from ts craft and finally if you click that subscribe button, you get future videos from me. Plus, on top of that, if you give me a thumbs up down below, it would actually help me out quite a bit and lets me know you like this video as well. So, thanks again. I'll be seeing you soon. Bye-bye.